What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back, guys. How are we doing today? Another day, another video on Madden, and guys, right after this, we will have a video on MLB. Stay tuned for that. Everyone was like, "Yo, Bugs, like you're not posting MLB." I'm doing both, so get ready. Um, we're gonna post more Madden than MLB, but we're still gonna post MLB, especially market videos. On Tuesday, I expect to have a Market Talk Tuesday vid on MLB and um, <clears throat> MLB and uh, Madden. So, anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the Madden so far. My pack opening was insane. We're probably going to have a pack opening for you to, um, today as well on MLB. Um, but, yeah, my pack opening went very solid. And I noticed that I wanted to talk about the auction because, you know, um, I know a lot about the auction every game I play, 2K, MLB, um, and Madden. So, I just want to talk to you about what's going to go down. As you know, I pop packs and I pulled a bunch of elites. And in this video, I'm going to tell you what to do with your elites, how to make coins, and what you should do with your coins in general. So let's get into it. So what I noticed right off the bat is when you go into your binder, oh, this is sets. When you go into your binder, I just want to talk about this. Um, Win a game. I, I didn't even play a game. So when you go into your binder, you're going to notice that um, a lot of these elites are very, 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 very cheap right now. And I'm going to tell you what this means. So yes chris harris and saquon yeah they're quick sell values anyone gonna buy them no um so every elite right now in the game is actually very cheap and i know this for a fact because i've been playing madden through ea access for whenever it came out i don't know when it came out was it madden 15 i don't know whatever the ea access came out for madden i was always playing the game before everybody always playing on ea access and what i noticed is that Every single elite when the game first drops is so cheap and let me tell you why so When the game comes out Everybody a lot of people spam packs, right? So let's say for instance I spam packs I pull 12 elites now I would like to sell my elites, but this is the problem I'm not gonna sell my elites because not a lot of people are gonna buy it number one Not a lot of people have the game for that long. It's only 10 hour trial a lot of people are probably grinding the game and also so this is what I'm saying so a quick way to explain it is that when the game actually comes out on August 2nd, more people are going to have the game, more people are going to pull leads, but more people are also going to buy cards and put them up. So there's going to be a higher demand for buying cards, which means everything is going to go up in value. Um, this happens every year. It's a very accurate, accurate thing to say. Um, if you have these quick sell cards, you could quick sell them. There's really no value in them. I mean, if you get away with selling them for a lot, that'd be awesome. But I'm going to go over some examples. So right here, Devin McCourty, 83. Now, Devin McCourty is a very solid card, 83 overall, especially this early in the game. You would like a player like this, especially this early in the game. He's 22K. Now, an 83 overall is 22K this early. I really don't think he would stay at that. I say he goes up to 30 plus. Think about it. All these cards, look how long they've been up here for. Um, these cards have been up here for a while because nobody wants to buy these cards. Who wants to buy an 83 overall right now? You don't even know what he's going to go for. You don't know his actual price. The game isn't out. Matt, a lot of my subs are like, yo, how'd you get the game early? A lot of people don't even know that EA Access is a thing. So yeah, make sure if you have a lot, literally if you have coins like for my quick sales, I might go invest and try to make a ton of coins. Um, honestly, I probably will do that because I could go buy Saquon Barkley 83 for pretty cheap and I'm actually going to show you right now. Let's check it out. Let's see how much the Sa Saquon is. Um, his quick sells at 55. Let's check his actual price. So let's go 83, uh, Giants running back. We're going to go over a bunch of players, what you should do. Um, Saquon's probably really, really cheap. He's probably, yeah, look at this, 40K. So now his quick sell card goes for 55K quick sell. So right now at 40K, it's Saquon Barkley. Do you really think he's going to stay at this price? I don't think so. Saquon Barkley is a beast. He's one of the best running backs in the league, if not the best. Um, his stats last year were crazy. He's so cheap, 40K. Everybody's going to want this Saquon. Another running back that I was looking at as cheap as well, who went off last year, is Kamara. And where is he? Alvin Kamara. 27k. And also, so 27k is also very cheap. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He's even cheaper. He's 26.7. You're talking about Alvin Kamara. 83 overall is 26k. This might be a very good investment for August 2nd when the game comes out. 
This could be a very good investment, especially these dudes right here. A left tackle 82 for 15k. Um, that's very cheap as well. There's not even a lot of high overall game cards in the game yet. This is crazy. It's just the market is flooded and nobody's really buying cards. And as you can see, I just missed out on a snipe. I didn't even realize. So yeah, a lot of people are just throwing up cards, trying to get their coins now, but they're not going to make any coins. They're just going to lose coins unless they're trying to snipe cards. That's different. Um, we're probably gonna have a ton of sniping videos on here for you as well, but let's check some 84 to 85s. So ready, an 84 overall center, Rodney Hudson. Is that a... No, it's not a snipe. So an 84 overall center, probably one of the top centers in this game. Let's check that out, actually. So we got 84 to 85. Let's go center. Let's see. What's the cheapest 84 to 85 center? So ready, Rodney Hudson is the cheapest center at 25K. His stats are actually very good. And first of all, everybody knows Rodney Hudson's good. So at 25K, I don't see him staying here. So, this is a very good investment as well. We got wide receivers. We got Devontae Adams, 84 at 35K. He'll probably be 50-ish K when the game comes out. Diggs at 36K. He'll probably be 50-ish when the game comes out. Uh, let's see. What else we got? Adam Thielen. Adam Thielen's very expensive, actually. But he'll probably go up to 70. If you remember last year, um, every year, every time EA Access drops, I always make the mistake on selling my cards in the beginning. It's never, ever a good time to sell. Nobody's on the game if you sell now, you're going to lose coins. There's not a lot of demand. Whoever buys the cards are just having a stacked team because they probably have a million coins off some crazy glitch or something. But what I'm saying is just make sure. And look at this. So, for instance, this is what I'm saying. The price gap. Like, this 10K price gap. Like, if you buy this, you're going to lose coins because nobody's going to buy the card at 47K. Like, this is what I'm saying. This is a perfect prime example of saying that the market is dead and nobody's on the game. Who wouldn't buy this 10k gap? That's what I'm saying. It's a perfect example of this 10k gap. Helvin Smith's a beast too. So if you guys know what I'm saying, just listen to me. Um, a ton of investments are in the game right now. Drew Brees for 30k seems like a snag. Andrew Luck's a snag. Phillip Rivers, like literally all these cards. My top investment right now, I would say is probably Alvin Kamara. Uh, Melvin Gordon at 33k is a very good investment as well. Let's see. How about 86 overall running back? So we got how much? Ezekiel Elliott, 89K. That's also a very good investment. I probably see him going up to like 120, 130. Gurley's at 130. He'll probably go up. Because realistically, bro, when no one's really going to pull these cards. These are the rarest cards in the game pretty much. Um, you have to realize that these cards right here, no one's buying because no one has the coins to buy them. They're going to go up a ton. I might invest in an Ezekiel Elliott actually or a Melvin Gordon because those are definitely good investments. It's definitely 100% good investments. I'm also going to go over some of the players I pulled. And we're going to just check it out. Hold up. Let's get there. So ready? Some of the players I pulled. So I'm gonna, I pulled a lot of 80 overall elites. Let's see. So we got Jimmy Smith 80. Jimmy Smith 80 is at 8K. Think about it. Um, He'll probably go up to 12. He probably won't go up that much. Might go up a little bit. Probably not a lot. Because it's very common to pull these elites. Uh, we got Dante Hightower, 80. Is he about 8? He's 11K. Not a bad price. You could probably go ahead and sell your... This is what I recommend, okay? So, let's say you have like 10 80 overalls, right? I would go ahead and sell your low overalls if you have no coins. And just try to cop some 83s, 82s. Get some gameplays with them. Abuse their card. And then just go ahead and sell them when the auction goes up. Whenever the game drops. Uh, for instance, I'm just quick selling him. I got a quick 26K from that. That was beautiful. So yeah, Saquon, Chris Harris, if you have the quick sell cards, you could pretty much go ahead and quick sell them because realistically, they don't go for anything more anyways, considering you could just go buy the 84 for uh, cheap. So yeah, I'm going to quick sell him and I'm going to quick sell my Saquon and Bugs is ready to invest. Uh, we got 166k. We still got a ton of elites left. We got a ton of points left. We're going to rip some bundles and as per usual, guys. Um, before I head out to the video, be sure to drop a like. Someone will win 10k in the comments. Um, if we get the vid to 50 likes on Madden, we will give away 10k coins in Madden. Um, just guys, stay tuned for some sniping videos. Stay tuned for some auction tips. We got Madden LB channel. It's growing. It's growing. I hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Be sure to like and sub if you are new. That's all I got. Peace.
Oh, oh.